food, milk, clothes. They'll even give you dog food. This might be different than Laos. A lot of them's on Social Security. And uh, this just helps them, you know, to, to get the hens to move. Hey, Rick. Yeah, it's good to meet you, too. All right. Yeah, just set it down there. All right, here you go. If it were not for Catholic Charities, that 23-year-old van there is what Lola and I would still be living in. We were refugees um, from Thailand. My parents' dream is for me to be a U.S. citizen, so she'll be proud. It will help open up opportunities that were limited to me before. Mm -hmm. We knew we, we wanted to adopt and we had looked at many agencies. We realized that Catholic Charities here in Asheville had an adoption program. We were thrilled. It was just the, the thing that we waited for our whole marriage and we were just so excited and Catholic Charities made that happen for us. They don't let anyone that I know of down in any manner, any way, shape or form. Catholic Charities, no one looks down on you there. Not just this place, not just being where we go to see, seek help. Right. They're also like friends. Right. I will always be eternally grateful. I definitely do appreciate Catholic Charities. This is a wonderful thing that they're doing um, with helping people and the community. The right people in your life really makes a difference. Everything we ever wanted came true because of Catholic Charities with our family. How do you say thank you? for making your life easier. You say thank you.